Bruce, it's okay. The car's around front. Come on, Brucey, look at me. It's nothing to be ashamed of. Between you and me, I think your father was scared too. Martha. Whoa, Jewelry, hand it over. Stand behind me, Bruce. That's fine. Just take it easy. Pearls too. Now! <laughs> hey! <laughs> Master Bruce, Master Bruce, how are we, young man? How long was I out? About 12 hours. And if you ask me, it's about time you had some decent rest since this creature entered your life. Sometimes I question it myself, old friend. Sir? I wonder if I'm doing any good. If there's a point to all this. I know my sarcasm can be a bit too much, but my intentions are always to guide you, not discourage you. Why would you doubt yourself so? I'm tired, Alfred. My body's strong, but... In the end, the war just keeps on going, you know? doesn't mean I don't care anymore. It's just... You're being too hard on yourself, sir. You're only human. You do what one man can do. Actually, more than many a man is expected to do. How can one man bring so much fear to so many? I used to think I was that simple, but... I know I'm nothing compared to him. So desperate to be feared, to be perceived as some kind of a monster. If I may interject, is this really about him? Why do you ask? <laughs> well, I ask because one thing has nothing to do with the other. You should take care to remember that. You know, I was just a kid. And my folks took me to the movies for a treat. The film was about a great hero who fought the criminals, saved the people. I was so excited on the walk back to the car, I couldn't talk about anything else. And then we turned into an alley. That's where everything went wrong. I never saw them again after that night. If only we'd been more cautious. If only there'd been a hero to save them. You don't blame yourself for that night, do you, sir? Nothing ever made up for the fact that I'd lost them. But you, you helped me through it all, Alfred. I grew stronger. My mind became sharp. I learned how to survive. When I'd learned what I could, I made a promise. I vowed to protect this city and to right the wrongs wherever I found them. I learned a lot about the evil in this world. They're weak, afraid, superstitious. I had to make them fear. But now I see the funny side. They don't fear me. 
They fear him. And I've let this happen and kept them alive just so you can continue mocking me. I guess that was the joke. Sana. Life could have been very different. Well, if your parents had lived, your life would have taken a different course, and Gotham would not have Batman. You made a good choice, sir, and your parents would be proud of you. You give this city hope, and hope excels fear. Hope is what makes us strong. It is why we are here. It is what we fight with. Without it, there will always be a Joker. There is no cure for him. Only a Batman. Is there hope to have a normal life, Alfred? The Wayne Foundation contributes a fortune to anti-crime programs. The police... I, I just keep asking myself one thing. Why don't I retire? There's always a choice, Master Bruce. But I must ask you, if your parents were here today and told you to give up all of this, would you have honored that? Yeah, yes. You're lying to yourself. I'm only saying you are being disingenuous. If your mother and father had begged you to give up who you are, you would have refused them. You cast your life to a purpose, regardless of the catalyst. Simply put, you are that man because it is who you are meant to be. And your only sin would be to give up what your heart truly feels. And I think you owe it to your parents to stick to your purpose and your calling. Hmm. Now, we don't want to be late for our appointment as well. Now, do we? Alfred. Thanks. Well? He's not picking up. Who's not picking up? Harvey. Harvey's not picking up. He's just... Harvey? You know we don't like to be called that. I think he's mad at me. Why do you think this? I don't know. Anyway, do me one last thing. Call him back. This time, leave a message. Tell him I'm coming to see him. I'm sure when the harvest will hear me out. I'm sure, I'm sure they'll hear me out. Yeah. Yeah, sure. On second thoughts, I'll do it myself. Mm -hmm. 